Now the time approaching three o'clock. Let's take a look at the weather forecast. And Louise is back with us. Hi, Louise. Hi there. We're definitely stuck in a rot at the moment with the weather. It's been the same all week. It continues into the weekend as well. This area of low pressure really not going very far, very fast. It drifts around in the North Sea over the next day or so. Still the driving force of our weather right throughout the weekend. So the sunny spells, but also the very heavy showers are set to continue. Some of these that for the rest of this afternoon will be really slow moving and thundery. It started off quite quiet. Showers across the far north of Wales became more widespread into the afternoon. A real cluster of thunderstorms now gathering in the southeast corner. And I suspect that those showers will continue for the next few hours to come. We'll also see some heavier ones up into the north of England and southern Scotland for a time as well. These are likely to continue overnight. But for the early evening, there's a bit of an improvement, particularly across areas like Wales. You will see a drier, brighter end to your day here. Northern Ireland, fewer showers and more brighter slots by 7 o'clock in the evening, the same to the Western Isles, but we can still see some pretty sharp downpours across central and southern areas of uh, Scotland. These are likely to be quite slow moving as well. There's going to be a lot of surface water and standing water on the roads for your early evening rush hour. The same too for the far northeast of England as well. Into the London area and along with the Midlands, we should already start to see those showers fading away. So much better journey home from work, I suspect, uh, for this evening. A few showers just lingering on the south coast and they will sit there for much of the night to come. In fact, through the night, we keep that drier slot across Wales, the Midlands, the southeast corner. The cloud breaking up, the sky is clearing, a touch of light frost forming and maybe some mist and fog patches. Rain continues to the south and the north of that and that's how we start our day on Saturday morning. Generally, our temperatures sitting at around four to six degrees. So for many of us, particularly across England and Wales, we'll start off dry and bright, make the most of it. We've got this rain down into the south, which will linger and cling on to the south coast. We've also got some sharp, intense, slow moving downpours across parts of southern Scotland and northeast England. As the day continues, widespread showers become more uh, popular throughout the country and we're looking at highs generally of around 11 to 14 degrees. Now, not much change as we move towards the week Sunday, so it's the marathon in London. It means a chilly start first thing, a dry start for the elite runners, but I suspect perhaps for the fun runners a little later on in the morning and into the early afternoon, those showers certainly will be quite a feature. So little change in the weather forecast into the weekend. It stays unsettled as well for the early part of next week too. Take care.